Good day to you. It's Wednesday, July 20th, 2016. This is Bob coming to you live from the Casa del Green here above the Rose Bowl. I'm out in the, the southern woodshed uh, out here above the big fire pit. And uh, you can see it's a, a real rustic camp setting, as you, you might know. Hope we'll see you in September on the 15th, 24th of September for my last birthday. Uh, my last, my 50s, that is. Well, today's word is sacrifice, sacrifice. And we make lots of sacrifices as human beings, but let's see why we do that and, and what the what the deal is. What's the dealio? All right, in Proverbs, Proverbs 21, verse two, it says, every man's way is right in his own eyes, but the Lord weighs the heart. How about this one? <clears throat> Luke 9, 24 and 25. Luke 9, 24 and 25. For whoever wishes to save his life shall lose it. But whoever loses life for my sake, he is the one who will save it. For what is a man profited if he gains the whole world and loses or forfeits himself? And one last one. I love this one. This is John 15, 13. John 15, 13. And it says here, Greater love has no one than this, that he lay down his life for his friends. And of course, Jesus Christ is our ultimate model, our ultimate example. He, he's the one that, that sacrificed and sacrificed and sacrificed. And yet, his sacrifices benefited because he was holy. He was God. And his sacrifice made a way for us to have access to the Father. That's the difference. You see, all these other holy people and these folks that, that say, well, I, yeah, I just, I cut my hair, I'm wearing clothes, I'm doing this, I'm doing that. Whatever you want to talk about, it's not getting anything, really. I mean, it's all kind of filthy rags. It's only because Jesus Christ was holy, sinless. His sacrifice was acceptable. And his sacrifice broke the chains of hell and death. And so, once we access, if you haven't accessed Jesus Christ's sacrifice, if you have not accepted him in your heart, then let's do that right now. Let's just stop for a moment. Father God, we just receive you now. We ask you to come into our heart and to sup with us, and we'll sup with you. Lord, we confess that we're sinners, and we want to live with you forever. And God, we thank you for your sacrifice. We receive it. We want to be filled with the Holy Spirit, and we want to walk with you in Jesus' name. Amen. All right. Well, if you've done that, then you're a, you're a believer now. And so go ahead and start to talk to Jesus, get to a Bible-believing church, and start reading God's Word. How about that? All right. For the rest of us, though, today, on this fine Wednesday, let's let's go ahead and let's let's find ways to in, 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 in service and in gratitude say thank you by sacrificing. It's not, that's, the, that's the whole thing. It's a whole pivot. It's a whole pivot.